The following presentation is made possible by EA Sports Game Changers. What's going on guys? Ben Glugin here coming back at you with another video. Today, once again, I'd like to thank EA for the opportunity to come down and capture early footage. But I'm going to be showing you every single player in Madden NFL 19 with superstar development. So easiest way for me to do this was to go into a fantasy draft and check out all the players who had it. So I try to get an early pick and then showcase the players who might have had it. So clearly off the bat, you can see Marshawn Lattimore. If you guys are new here, I would appreciate you hitting that subscribe button for more Madden 19 content. Um, I would say almost especially franchise related as Carson Wentz. Also, you can see what his development was there. Um, so, you know, big shout out to EA. Subscribe if you guys are new. If you guys want to follow me on Twitter, links in that and Twitch into the description. Superstar development as well for Jalen Ramsey. So there's a big focus on these young guys that come out and performed at the top of their you know position group so an interesting thing about this year compared to last year is that there are way fewer superstar development players now previously you might see many within the same position group there are some positions in the game that do not even have superstar development aaron Rodgers would not be one of them he has superstar tom brady has superstar development although he is older russell wilson has superstar development. He's a younger player you might want to build around. Drew Brees, unfortunately for Drew Brees, uh, does not have superstar development. Deshaun Watson is an interesting one you might want to look out for, but he only has star. So he still is a young player. Cam Newton only has star. Those are the players with superstar development. At halfback, Ezekiel Elliott has superstar development. Todd Gurley has superstar development. Le'Veon Bell has superstar development and if you guys are so inclined if someone's nice enough down in the comment section below you can make an actual list of all these guys um perhaps i might even pin it i probably won't do that but david johnson superstar development as well a lot of running backs who have it kareem hunt is not one of them alvin kamara not one of them both of them have star which i think probably makes the most sense at fullback patrick reichardt has quick and i believe that was the uh the highest overall development uh, that there was for uh, for fullbacks. So uh, I think what I ended up doing here was advancing to the end of the draft and then starting it again because I accidentally forgot to uh, to pause, which was foolish of me. Uh, <laughs> so then it simulated through like the entire thing. And I do apologize. I did record this um, a couple weeks ago now, so so apologies. Uh, but uh. I'm just, I'm just super excited for Madden 19, guys. Hope you guys are as well. Probably, I think it's there's a pretty good chance a lot of you guys are watching this when the game is already out. Let me know what you think of uh, of the game so far. I think it's it's been a lot of fun so far playing it early. Hope it continues through, and I'm sure that it will. We had a super early pick this time, and I make sure, doubly sure, to, uh, to pause the draft this time as we go through and pick up where we left off uh, at fullback. And I'm pretty sure, if memory serves correctly, there is no fullback in the game with superstar development. As Yeah, Kyle Juszczyk only has star. And then at wide receiver, uh, there are quite a few, actually. It's one of those positions with, with a lot of them. Because it's one of those positions in the NFL with a lot of superstar caliber players. Odell Beckham Jr. being one of them with superstar development. DeAndre Hopkins has superstar. Antonio Brown, superstar. Julio Jones has superstar. And I believe those were the four, as Julian Edelman is the next one on the list. And he has star. DJ Moore star as well. Very interesting player to look out for. Rookie out of Maryland um, with the Panthers. Could be very, very good. Gronk has superstar development. And as you'd expect, Travis Kelsey also has superstar development before that drop off to Hunter Henry, who only has star. As far as left tackles go, Tyron Smith has superstar development. David Bakhtiari only has star. So there is only one left tackle in the entire game with superstar development. At left guard, I think it's a pretty obvious one here, in my opinion. But Quentin Nelson has superstar, and then Andrew Norwell only has star. So there's one left guard in the entire game with superstar development, and that is the rookie out of Notre Dame, Quentin Nelson at center. Superstar development. I believe there's only one again, and that is Travis Frederick. Rodney Hudson, as you can see, only has star. So there's one center in the entire game with superstar. At right guard, Zach Martin has superstar. And then David DeCastro, superstar. 
Only two right guards. Brandon Brooks, I'm pretty sure, only his star, as you can see that he does. Right tackle. I don't know why I would start with Rob Avenstein. Ryan Ramchek only has star. So there are no right tackles in the entire game with superstar development. That changes, though, at left tackle, excuse me, at left end. As Joey Bosa, indeed, has superstar development. Obviously, Khalil Mack has superstar. J.J. Watt, of course, is going to have superstar development. Cameron Jordan actually shocked me. As he has superstar development, I thought he would have star. But Demarcus Lawrence does have star. As far as right end go goes, uh, Miles Garrett has superstar development for that right end position. Aaron Donald, of course, has superstar development. Bradley Chubb, they gave superstar development before Everson Griffin has that drop off at star. As far as defensive tackles go, Fletcher Cox has superstar. Damon Harrison has superstar. I think they got that one right. And then Michael Pierce, star. And Dominic Sue, star. Moving on to left outside linebacker as far as development trait. We have Von Miller, clear superstar. I don't think anyone would disagree with that. And then Miles Jack only has star. So there's one left outside linebacker in the game with superstar development. Luke Keekley has superstar at middle linebacker. Bobby Wagner has superstar. Deion Jones only has star. I say only. Star is an awesome development to have. Ruben Foster has star as well. Right outside linebacker. Jadavion Clowney, superstar development. Levante David drops off to star. So only one right outside linebacker in the entire game was superstar. And I like that superstar is becoming a more rare trait. It makes it that much more valuable. We move on to cornerbacks. You guys already saw Marshawn Lattimore, but we're going to show him again. Superstar development on the second year player now. Desmond Trufant has superstar. Tredavious White, only star. So there are only two cornerbacks in the entire game with superstar development, which seems low to me. At free safety, Harrison Smith has superstar. Earl Thomas has to drop off to star. Dwight Lowry is next with quick. And same with Jimmy Ward, which is interesting. And then at strong safety, Derwin James. This is going to be a player to have in franchises, let me tell you. Superstar development on him. Eric Berry has superstar. Keanu Neal is, of course, the drop off at star. At kicker, I believe there's only one, and that is the beast. That is Justin Tucker, Hook'em Horns, and then Jake Elliott has star. And then a punter, Johnny Hecker might have it. And then uh, he does the super, and then Market King does not. But that's going to do it for me, guys. Hope you guys learned something. Try to keep it short. Try to target some of these players in your franchises because they're going to be extremely valuable. But that will do it for me. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy.